what's the best way to use images rather than words on a PowerPoint to get your point across to your audience? Well, the answer to that question will be found in your next Daily Dose of Public Speaking Wisdom. In yesterday's tip, you heard about the challenge of, of overwhelming your audience with too many words. One solution to that problem is to shorten the definition of a term or an idea into just a few words, one sentence at most. This tip is about using images instead of words. Let's go back to the term we used yesterday, systematic desensitization. I'm sure I don't need to read it to you again. I'm, I'm positive that after you saw that video, you memorized it. But just in case you didn't, here's what systematic desensitization means. It's a type of behavior therapy used to help people effectively overcome phobias and other anxiety disorders. Based on classical conditioning, it shares the same elements of cognitive behavioral therapy and applied behavior analysis. It incorporates counter-conditioning principles such as meditation and breathing. Just makes you want to run out and speak, doesn't it? How could images better help us get this point across? What if I say this? With systematic desensitization, you can go from this to this. What are the feelings and emotions generated by those images? If you're a person who has anxiety or fear, that picture on the left is speaking to you, isn't it? You know exactly what this woman is feeling. These images are so powerful because they show a before and after. If you've seen some of my previous videos on storytelling, it's a powerful storytelling technique. As you're putting your next presentation together, when you come across definitions or ideas, it can be a little complicated. Ask yourself this question. How can I take this to its simplest form? What is the essence of what this point is? Systematic desensitization is a wonderful technique, but it all boils down to the fact that you have to get up and speak over and over again. And if you do, you can go from fear and anxiety to confidence, impact, and influence. And many times, an image will sell the idea that you're trying to get across. Yeah.